is a world broadcast premiere. Elisa Strata, she has a brand new track. Uh, so, you got a new song? Yeah, it's a brand new right single. Here. Big Boom and Voice Guy just kind of told us. Come here, come here, let me talk to you. Let me tell you about the Hitmakers. The Hitmakers is a TV show unlike any other TV show. This is a real behind the scenes look at how artists are created. Brother. How are you, man? It's not karaoke. It's not a contest about, you know, who's the greatest singer, let's get them an album. This is about an independent record label taking talent and taking them from zero to hero. This is a, a hardworking girl, you know, and that's kind of one of the big reasons why she became such a huge priority for us. Did you see that? This was when I was like 16, I think. I struggled for years, you know, I would get so close and I felt like I wanted to give up. You want to take the wheel? All right, here we go. We found Elisa Strada's result of a radio contest. <laughs> and um, Elise won. And luckily, Michael and Adam decided to sign me. We knew that when we chose her, that something special was going to happen. This is a show about an independent record label who fights with the major labels to get top spot on the charts. So this is the latest from Elisa Strata. You're gonna love it. This song is a monster hit. I'm dying for you to hear this song. You ready for this? It's a hit, man. It's a hit. Literally a week after signing the contract, I got on a plane and traveled from city to city with Adam promoting my debut single. This is how it really happens. So tune into the Hitmakers and watch it unfold. Hey, thank you, brother. Is it hit? Where is that track right now? You see us make deals with radio stations. You see us turn artists that have never before had a hit into number one hit recording artists. I'm in Vancouver as we speak. Landed a little while ago. Adam's uh, here with me and we're just kind of driving around. I heard the brand new Elise track. It's a smash. I want to get on like ASAP. I want it on the air within the next 15, 20 minutes. Uh, this could be number one on iTunes uh, within weeks. You hear about the music business having problems and how record sales are down? Well, companies like us are shining. We have not had one flop record yet, and we're not intending on it. It's like a well-structured, well-oiled machine. <laughs> I love them. They're high energy. They help right from the beginning, from the songs right down to what you're wearing on stage. These guys are awesome. I can't say enough about them. And if you want a number one hit, it'll happen. Well, of course, you need guys like me as well. Billboard number billboard one. Billboard number one. Billboard. We love the word billboard. Love billboard. billboard. Thank you, billboard. The Hitmakers is a real, real TV show about the music business. You see them on tour, you see them in stadiums, you'll see them with 50 Cent and all these other superstars of today and see our independent label take them to the top. Basically the old Motown way of, of developing an artist. That it factor is that indescribable magic that you know that you can capture it with the right artist, with the right time, with the right promotion and the magic and the music that's what's taking place here. That, to me, is the exciting part of this whole thing. Yeah, it's, it's a new era in the music business. And I just won this! Yeah, so Insatiable went to number one for four weeks. It was the number one Canadian single in the country. Number one. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay. I really didn't think I was going to win anything, so I have absolutely nothing prepared. Hi, to be Jackson here. Adam H., how you doing, brother? Dude, good. What's going on? Uh, I've got the new Elisa Strata single. Rob Mize is in town. I just played it for him, and he wants to play it, like, in 15 minutes. What are you talking about? When he asked for a link, and, you know, in the uh, heat of the moment, I... She's our girl, right? We discovered her. Uh, why don't we get first yeah. crack? <laughs> You'll love the song, like, in five minutes, I swear. Dude, help her. You want her to debut it on the air? During, yeah, absolutely. You want her there today? If it's a real world premiere, if Calgary beats us, then no. This is a real look on how artists get overnight success. Oh, hey, give me some love. Give me some love. Give me some love. Uh -huh. It shows how a small independent label cuts through the major label clutter to take new artists to make them stars. Yes, it is brand new. 
Elisa Strata, who just happens to be joining us in studio. How you doing? Good, how are you? Essentially, two of the biggest stations in the country are both starting the song today. Just on one guy hearing it in the car. Yeah. So you should probably play it at some point. I think you should. Hey, I'm Adam H. I'm Michael Hectone. And you're watching The Hitmakers. Elisa Strata, Canada's number one superstar. The world's next superstar, actually, dude. Thank you. <laughs> crazy, crazy, crazy. Who would have thought this? I mean, I knew we had a hit. It's crazy. I can't even, I'm speechless. Canadian radio is amazing.